Welcome to Storytime Pals. Subscribe to keep the stories coming. Hiya friends, it's your pal Amber here. And since today is Earth Day, I'm going to read to you a book all about Earth Day and where it came from and why we celebrate it. Are you ready? Let's read the book called Earth Day. All right. Earth Day is a holiday when we celebrate the environment. What is the environment? Just look around. The ground, water, air, plants, and animals all make up the environment. A clean environment helps people stay healthy. People need to drink clean water, breathe clean air, and eat food that grows in clean soil. People can get sick if the environment is dirty. It's true, right? How does the environment get dirty? Cars and factories fill the air with smog. See that smog? Have you ever seen that coming out the back of a car? Smog can make it hard for people to breathe. That's no good. Garbage pollutes or dirties the water and soil. Plants and animals cannot grow well because of the garbage. It's true. Pollutes means dirties. That's why you should never throw your trash on the ground, right? Because an animal might eat it and that's not good. Gaylord Nelson started Earth Day in 1970. He wanted to save the environment. Mr. Nelson taught people about the things that hurt our land, water, and air. That's good to know, huh? He wanted to do a good thing. I want to save the environment, too. Let's learn some more. Today, we celebrate Earth Day every year in the month of April. This holiday reminds us to take good care of our environment. Like other holidays, Earth Day can be a time for celebrations. Some towns have festivals with music, rides, and parades. But the earth is still not as clean as it could be. The smog and garbage have not gone away. So, on Earth Day, Children and adults around the world do things to help the environment. That's cool, huh? Groups of people plant trees. Trees help keep the ground and the air healthy. They create oxygen too. Some school children plant vegetable and flower gardens. They help with the gardens grow. They help the gardens grow with healthy plant food. They do not use chemicals that can hurt the soil. And chemicals are not good for you to eat, right? Mm -hmm. We should try to keep them out of our food. Many people start recycling programs to safely throw away plastic, paper, and glass. These things do not go in the garbage. Do you recycle at home? Other people think of ways to stop wasting water. One way is to turn it off while you brush your teeth. That's what I do. I get my toothbrush wet and I put my toothpaste on it and I turn off the water while I'm brushing my teeth and then I turn it back on to rinse my toothpaste in my mouth. That's what I do. Earth Day is not the only day when you can help make the environment clean and healthy. You can do it every day of the year. It's true, every day. Think of something you can do to help keep the earth clean. All right, have fun doing it. Bye, thanks for listening. Thanks for watching Storytime Pals. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.